before it was called Fort Nashboro, which eventually 15 years later becomes Nashville, was called the Bluff Station. And so you had Mansker Station, you had the Bluff Station. This is all part of a 20 million acre purchase from the Cherokee Indians. So right through the middle of Kentucky, down through Tennessee, you have a whole series of stations in order to guard the frontier. Donaldson and Robertson arrived here in the spring of 1780. One of the ladies that was on one of the boats mentioned that there were already a couple pole cabins started up on the bluff. So these logs, if you want to walk around the corner, those logs are part of this log cabin here. Oh, I see. And this is what's referred to as a pole cabin. So they were just chopped down, left in the round, and then uh, notched and put up. So we're doing this building to replicate what those people saw that was already sitting on the bluff because there were settlement here before uh, Robertson and Donaldson got here. In order to build all that you see, took a little over three linear miles of log to hew with a broad axe. Every one of those logs I hewed with this axe. It's actually a 200 year old axe, but that doesn't mean anything.